Oh, well, thanks for letting me know. Yep, you too. Is there a problem? Corey's been charged with murder and GBH. Oh, that was great news. It's what you wanted. So why aren't I doing cartwheels? Because it's a lot to process, love. Yeah, I guess. Anyway, the, uh, the bail hearing's this afternoon and I want to be there. <laughs> Goes without saying. I'll let Ty know I won't be in today. But you don't have to come with me. Oh, behave. Says, I want to watch him suffer. Oh, the suffering and suffering. If I hadn't called that ambulance. Yeah, well, you did the right thing. Did I? How is it right that Corey's still breathing and Seb isn't? How is that fair, Kev? It isn't fair. Nowhere near. But it's the only way Seb gets justice. Can't get bail. Not on a murder charge. He could be on a ferry in a way. Seen the shoes and his lawyer. 600 quid a pop. He's got a pop a fight. Oscar. Your Honour, Corey Brent is a diligent student from a stable, supportive home. Aside from his academic prospects, Corey is a regular volunteer at a local food bank and a promising player at the Weatherfield County Football Academy. He has never been in trouble with the police. This respectable, caring lad has a bright future. He is no more likely to present a flight risk than you or I. Thank you, Mr. Carter. Uh, might I add, Your Honour, that since his alleged accident, my client has been suffering flashbacks and panic attacks, most likely brought on by the fear of losing his footballing career. We believe detention will only exacerbate these attacks. Violin out. Therefore, I'm requesting bail, conditional upon a security payment from his family. I understand feelings in the local community are running high. And with that in mind, Your Honour, we propose Mr Brent should continue to reside at his parents' address several miles away from Coronation Street. He must agree to have no contact, direct or indirect, with the deceased's family or friends, and to wear a tag and report daily to his local police station. Bail conditions agreed. Agreed? Well, just like that. How is that fair? 